The day after the tournament ends, we start again. And actually, we're making notes now for next year. Wow, okay, the popularity. Well, with 3D tournaments alone, it's popular. And with Mark 3D, that's popular in Northern California. And started out with probably 300 people shooting the tournament back in the 80s, which has grown and grown. I have been at Reading for nine straight years now. It was actually my first, what I call, real archery tournament that was not local 3D. And so I actually grew up shooting this course from the time I was like two years old. And I've won it four years in a row. So if I can manage to pull it off this year, I really want to, I'll make it five in a row. So I'm crossing my fingers, that's what I'm trying for. So this is the club that makes it all happen. Uh, the Straight Arrow Bow Hunters Club here, Redding, California. Northern California is where we're at. And they have been doing this uh, tournament for 35 years, I believe we heard. Shoot's been going on since about 1983. It started out as a one day tournament which was only 42 animals at the time. Then we went to a two-day tournament. We expanded that to 60. And then we have been probably at 70 targets for the last six to seven years. We have three tournaments in one. We have the Western Classic Trail Shoot, which are the amateurs competing. We have the NFAA, which is the National Field Archery Association's 3D Mark Championship. And then we also have the money shoot of the Western Classic Trail Shoot. Well, it's, it's come a long way since that first year. Uh, I shot as an amateur that first time and I was well down the list, not even mid-pack. and had a steady climb since then and I actually have had some success the last few years. Some of it was heartbreak, but I've been in the first place shoot-off three times now and, and last year in 2017 I finally cracked it and got the win.